On August 15, 1997, Harvey Weinstein reached a $100,000 settlement with the actress Rose McGowan, binding her to not pursue legal action against him after she alleged that he raped her at the Sundance Film Festival in Park City, Utah, earlier that year. The following year, Weinstein paid £250,000, roughly $600,000 today, in a settlement with two female employees in his London office. The women alleged UAL harassment and assault, respectively, and split the settlement evenly. The money was paid out of his brother Bob Weinstein's personal bank account, and bound the women to remain silent about their allegations. A provision in the agreement also barred the women from possessing copies of the legal agreement. One of them, Zelda Perkins, obtained several pages of the document and recently began talking to the press, flouting a non-disclosure agreement that she now feels is unjust. I think it's a really important symbolic thing to do right now, she said. To stand up and question its legitimacy publicly, settlement with Rose McGowan accepted the settlement with Zelda Perkins.